Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nalito Faiza. I would like to present my mini research, and the title is Students' Perception and Preferences in Literal Reading Course in English Department of Komarudi University. The introduction. Background of the research. Learning foreign language is important, especially English language. In this globalization era and modern society, we need an important thing which can improve a foreign language, notably for students who want to learn foreign language, such as English language. It is very important for them to learn language skills, especially to learn reading skills. Reading is one of imperative abilities that are good to be dominated by the students. Reading comprehension is the process of getting the information or construct meaning from the reader and writer. There are four levels of reading comprehension. The first is literal level, the second is inferential level, the third is critical level, and the last is creative level. Literal comprehension is recognized as the first and most basic level of understanding in reading. Students can use literal comprehension skills to find information more effectively. In literal reading course, the students have perception and preferences. The lecturer must also know the perception and preferences in students in literal reading course so that the lecturer can address what students like and want in literal reading course. Identifying students' perception and preferences in literal reading course can be used to know students' weakness in literal reading course and what their hopes in literal reading course. Problems of the research the first is, how is students' perception in literal reading course in English Department of Komarudi University? And the second is, how is students' preferences in literal reading course in English Department of Komarudi University? Objective of the research The first is, to know the students' perception in literal reading course in English Department of Komarudi University. And the second is, to know the students' preferences in literal reading course in English Department of Komarudi University. Methodology Research method and instrument. The study used survey research methods and these methods as creation using a questionnaire to gather information from a group of people. The data collect from a population sample and the subject respond to the question is summarized, analyzed, and report. The subject whose data were collected were all students from the first semester at Komarudi University. This research used the open closed questionnaire that contains some open question and some closed question. According to Ari Kunto, open questionnaire like the respondents answer the question with their opinions and closed questionnaire like the respondents choose have to choose their answer. And discussion Findings the research result described here are related to the result obtained from a list of questions on the questionnaire. The number of sample is 18 students from the first semester, consists of 40 female respondents and 4 male respondents, and their age range from 18 to 22 years old. In the questionnaire, there are 15 questions about students' perception and preferences in literal reading course. Question number 1 until question number 10, uh, use a closed questionnaire because the respondents just have to choose their answer. For question number 1, the question is whether the respondents like reading or not. And it was found that there are 70 respondents like reading and only one respondent don't like reading. For question number 2 is what kind of reading the respondents like. It was found that 9 respondents like reading and novels. Four respondents like reading short stories, three respondents like reading articles, and two respondents like reading others. For question number three is whether the respondents like reading text in English or not. It was found that 11 respondents like reading text in English, and seven respondents don't like reading text in English. For question number four is how often did the respondents read the text in English. It was found that one respondents would read the text in English every day, six respondents would read the text in English twice a week, five respondents would read the text in English three times a week, four respondents would read the text in English more than three times a week, and two respondents would never read the text in English. Question number five is what kind of English text do the respondents often read? It was found that Nine 
respondents often read the descriptive text, three respondents often read the personal text, one respondents often read the recount text, three respondents often read the narrative text, and two respondents often read the, op the explanation text. For question number six is, uh, what kind of English texts were easy for respondents to understand? It was found that nine respondents chose descriptive text, six respondents chose personal text, two respondents chose recount text, and one respondent chose narrative text. For question number seven is, what kind of English texts were difficult for respondents to understand? It was found that one respondent chose descriptive text, one respondent chose procedural text, and two respondents chose recount text, four respondents chose narrative text, eight respondents chose explanation text, and two respondents chose other text. For question number eight is whether the respondents like literal reading course or not. It was found that 40 respondents like literal reading course and four respondents don't like literal reading course. Question number nine is whether the respondents like the method of the lecture used to teach literal reading course. It was found that 13 respondents like the method and 5 respondents don't like the method. For the last question is whether the respondents ever been bored while learning literal reading course. It was found that 12 respondents ever feel bored and 6 respondents never feel bored. Number 11 until question number uh, 15 uh, use a open questionnaire because the respondents answer the question with other opinions. And for question number 11, the researcher asks what difficulties do respondents often face when learning literal reading course. Some opinions such as lack of understanding of new vocabulary, difficulty understanding lectures, explanation in a short time, and feeling less confident when they want to respond to the lecture explanation. For question number 12, the researcher asks, what is the respondent's opinion about literal reading course? Some opinions, such as some respondents think that literal reading course are important to learn. They think that learning literal reading is easy and fun. And also, some respondents think that literal reading course is boring and difficult to understand. For question number 13, the researcher asks respondents to write down what positive opinions they have for literal reading course. Some opinions such as help the respondents to get or find new information easily, to know new vocabulary, to master English grammar, to quickly learn English well, and to fill their spare time by learning literal reading. For question number 14, the researcher asks what do the respondents want to suggest for a lecture in literal reading course? Some opinions such as the respondents want lecture to use active, effective learning techniques that are easy for students to understand. They also want the lecture to give a lot of example and always review important points at the end of the lesson. And they want the lecture to give long deadlines for their assignment. For question number for, for question number fifteen, the researcher asks, "What do the respondents hope in the future to learn literal reading course?" Some opinions, such as the respondents hope that in the future they can develop even better in the learn in learning literal reading course. The respondents hope to learn a lot of a new vocabulary easily, and the respondents hope to get learning techniques that are easy to understand and fun from the lectures. And the discussion, based on the data obtained, it was found that the first is the student mostly like to read it. They read for the reason, like hobbies, getting information, getting knowledge, and others. And the second is the students like literal reading course. Uh, the several the several reasons like literal reading course are important to learn because uh, by learning literal reading course they can get new information and vocabulary and they also develop their reading skills. The third is most of the students also often feel bored and fo and face difficulties when learning literal reading course. Uh, and the reasons are such as the material that is difficult to understand. Uh, the lack of vocabulary they know and the learning techniques used are not interesting. 
The fourth is the students hope that the lecture can provide an efficient or fun method so uh, that the students could understand more easily and did not feel bored when learning literal reading course. The last is the students hope that in the future they can develop even better in literal reading course. Conclusion The conclusion of this research is that most of the first semester students at Homology University lack like literal reading course. Sometimes, some of them also feel bored when learning literal reading. That's why they want to lecture can teach literal reading course in a method that is interesting and easy for students to understand. In the future, they want literal reading course at Homology University can be better than before, so that more students enjoy learning literal reading course. Okay, I think enough for me. Uh, I'm sorry if there are so many mistakes. Uh, and thank you for your attention. The last I say, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.